Yeah. 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 Ye
post-contact. We probably didn't get everything right around some of our tackle selection. But, um, yeah, you put Gilly's technical knowledge and, and the boy's heart into it and uh, and we showed right at the end. You I say to the lads, you don't have to be perfect to win a game of footy. You don't have to win every battle to win the war. you just got to win most of them. And uh, you can make an error and then defend like we did. We made a few errors in that last 20, but we just defended with our nuts out and really sort of kept them out. I'm sure there's a, a few sore bodies in the team. There were... A few bone-crunching tackles out there. I'm, I'm sure they must be happy to uh, take that hot shower and, and, and review for next week. Jakey, physical, <laughs> physical out there? Yeah, it was physical. We knew that coming into the game. Fijians play a fast attacking you know, style of rugby and they're hard like cement too. And they, when they hit you, they make sure they hit you. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm expecting the Fijians to grow. Uh, they'll be a really dangerous team down the track. Any reason for how fiery it was out there? If you, uh, oh, it's the first game of the year, always a little bit fiery. Uh, two competitive teams going at it. That's You get that first game of the year. It was a cool moment to be involved in. Like the f I was talking about, I know a few of their, both their coaches, Mick and Brad Harris, and for their country and such a proud rugby nation like Fiji, it's, I'm glad we're involved. They, they asked us... Would we mind them doing their, their, their tribal dance, their, their, their challenge there? Uh, and I believe it's an advantage to them, but geez, that's the stuff you want to be there. You want to, these boys remember, remember the time we faced the Fijian dance in, in their first ever game in Super Rugby. I reckon that's pretty cool for our lads to be a part of. And uh, it's a beautiful thing for the Fijian culture. And how many, how many Fijians are in the crowd? So good. Mm. You've still got that fun at Leichhardt and Paper Dragon Kid. Tars fans back on board? Yeah, I am. Yeah, I really am. Um, 8,000 there tonight. Uh, I understand it's because it's such a great stadium. It was noisy. The boys said it was noisy. But we get the uh, we get those 8,000 and we, we add a few more on. You get ten or 12,000 in the Leichhardt. You like when back when Benny and Blocker were playing. It'll be, uh, <laughs> she'll be uh, a good atmosphere. And um, I reckon we can, we got five of our next six home games here. I reckon we can turn that into a bit of a fortress. This is a special arena, isn't it? No, nah, it's close. It's it's tight. That grandstand's right on you. The hill's awesome. Um, yeah, I really hope the and it's and it's accessible from all all axes. So uh, people can come from the west, south, north, east to come along and have a look. So I yeah, it'd be my my dream if we can fill those pubs around Balmain this year and get them rolling in and, and get that ten or twelve, fifteen thousand. Uh, it'd be awesome. And particularly playing against Queensland, it'd be should be a good night next Friday night. Darren, are you a little bit disappointed by the impact of the, of the bench? Because it's really until the 60th minute you had a very strong platform. Mm. After that, the team struggled a bit. I know that the uh, the pigeon raised their uh, their game, but you lost a little bit of shape. And, uh... mm. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, like uh, you would have liked. Like you always chase some perfection, but it's, you never get it. Um, not so much the bench. I, I reckon a lot of the the seven or, or eight guys that remained on there ran out of gas as well. So it wasn't just the bench that came on. Like, uh, there were some pretty tight boys. We had a lot of cramping. Like, all our front row, a lot of our type five were cramping, as were they. So I think it was, it was a hot night there tonight. First game, we, although we've played trials, blokes don't normally play past 50 minutes, 60 minutes in a trial. So once they got past 60 minutes, uh, uh, yeah. So I definitely don't blame the bench. But yeah, I was a little disappointed with the last 20.